Welcome to HTML4 video series and this is part 59 and I would say this is the end of the whole series. At the end I would like to say that we designed a website. I'm not bragging that we designed a class website. We designed something which is very simple. This can be you know done using uh, you know uh, divs or a lot of other things right but we chose that we'll be going by simply by the tables and inline CSS I mean inline CSS but in the end we learn a lot we learn a lot of about HTML4 what is HTML4 how it works we looked at most possible tags which are used you know in HTML4 right then we looked at I mean how I mean then we decided that we are going to create something like this so we created a plan and then we executed, executed that plan step by step and made this whole thing next we deployed the website onto the live then we looked at the FTP right then we looked at the control panel and we learned that how can you create a domain subdomain uh, you know stuff like that so it was pretty okay right and in the end I would like to have a look at the master plan which was the main agenda which we decided that we are going to do so these are the things why I have mentioned we covered HTML4 possible all the tags right then we decided that we are going to plan a website right then we build the website step by step we have chosen our tools tools are always up to your choices Visual Studio is my favorite but for you guys I need to get down to coffee cup and uh, it's also okay not a bad tool right in the end we went live and this was the time killer I had to really think like you know how I'm going to put this thing you know in the simplest way that you know a normal person I mean the non technical person can also get this thing very easily so we did this uh, following things and that was pretty cool right so this is the end and in future this is my agenda right which I am claiming that I'm going to do we are going to do uh, the HTML5 videos then the CSS3 which is the latest in the market so these are two uh, the rocking ones then we are going to look at the JavaScript the bootstrap and the knockout jQuery I have already covered I had already have the videos on jQuery so you can look at that but uh, we'll go you know step by step and I hope to see you in you know my future videos so thank you for watching and I would say <clears throat> thank you for watching all my videos and thank you for all the support right good night and take care bye bye